there are kids in the room right now, you may want to turn the volume down or maybe distract them from the next story. Okay, ready for this? Santa Claus, a mall Santa Claus, under arrest. Investigators charged this Santa Claus working at a mall with indecent assault and battery. And Beth Germano is live with the story for us in Hanover tonight. Beth? Paul is certainly not the way to kick off the holiday season. It seems the Santa at the Hanover Mall here, well, was rather naughty and not nice to a co-worker. And he wasn't happy when we tried to talk to him today. Far from the holiday spirit, this mall Santa made an obscene gesture at our camera as he drove away from his home. What he's charged with has many uncomfortable. Especially when you're involved with a job with a lot of kids and stuff. You don't want kids to be around someone like that. Still dressed in his Santa suit, 62-year-old Herbert Jones is accused of pinching the buttocks of a female co-worker who takes the pictures at the Hanover Mall display. Police say there were no children in the area at the time. The children weren't involved with this in the actual um, process of having the kids going up and getting, getting the picture taken with Santa Claus. This was not the case. The woman says it happened Saturday as she walked by Santa seated in his chair and claims Jones says he wished he was younger. The charge of indecent assault and battery concerns parents like Donna Devlin, who says it's a little early to be visiting mall Santa. The whole thing is completely creepy. I mean, what, what else is he doing when people aren't looking? Cherry Hill Photo, which hired Herbert Jones, says this allegation has been denied by the individual portraying Santa. A comprehensive background report had been completed on the individual portraying Santa. But in such an open area, parents say Santa's behavior is watched closely. If children see that or if, you know, it's, it's teaching them bad things. Now, according to court documents, this Santa says he actually tried to move his hand out of the way to avoid contact with the worker. And if Christmas Eve isn't busy enough, well, that's his next court date. Reporting live from Hanover, I'm Beth Germano, W.